Hi, this is Kani here. Uh, today we will see about uh, probe request and probe response frames. So probe request and probe, man uh, probe response frames are a part of a management frames. So the probe request is sent by our client. So it's a part of our active scanning process. So whenever the client tries to join to the APs, it broadcasts uh, with any specific SSIDs, or if it's already known, or it's broadcast with the wild card SSID. So it's a null SSID. There is no SSID name will be there. It's a wild card SSID. Here in my example, I have configured as a bizarre data. So this uh, SSID is, uh, uh, is trying to see the SSID's bizarre name. So they, it will, the client will go through each channel actually. So each, each channel it go and try to find out the APs here. So it has a probe timer. So the, it will wait for the response of the any APs from that particular channel. If we didn't uh, get the response from that, uh, any APs from that uh, uh, channel, it will go to the next channel, whatever is supported. So when you are planning or designing a wireless network, so you need to have the channel which are supported by the clients. Even though if you put that uh, channels which are not supported by the clients, the clients will not be able to find the APs here. So you need to know these specific details while designing the wireless network. So here it broadcasted this, uh, it goes through as a broadcast. So here see the source. So the laptop and transmitter address is the laptop here. The destination is, uh, and we uh, said is broadcast here, FFFF here. So then it's uh, broadcasting, uh, it's requesting for the SSID blizzard here. And what are the supporter rates by the laptop? So it says one, two, five point five, eleven, six, nine, eleven, eighteen. These are the my, uh, I, am, I am supporting this uh, data rates here. I am eleven and capable uh, client, so it shows the eleven capabilities. So it, it's sending this, broadcasting this. Then the AP is responding. So you see the beacon interval in this uh, probe response of the APs. And it shows, it uh, says about this uh, capabilities of these APs here. So what are the data rates supported? Uh, my data rates is, these are supported data rates and what is the basic uh, uh, data rate I support here? This AP is responding to the response to the client here. It says the country code here and the whole number of channels. What is the maximum transmit power I supported? by the APs here and what are the security capabilities of the APs here. So what security capabilities, this information. That's the capabilities of this uh, APs also. The in information is available here. The probe request uh, does not contain the traffic indication map. Like in the beacon frame, you will see the traffic indication map details. Uh, so that details will not be seen in the probe response of these APs. So the probe response to be particular uh, uh, specific to the each station, which requested that uh, uh, probe request, it will be response to the, the probe response to the particular stations here. So it's a, uh, the probe request and probe response is a part of the uh, association process uh, between the clients and the AP before it's really get authenticated and ready to transmit the data here. Thanks for watching.